ABC Kinder Teach presents Max Found Two Sticks, written by Brian Pinkney. Well, there's his two sticks. It was a day when Max didn't feel like talking to anyone. He just sat on his front steps and watched the clouds gather in the sky. Gathering in the sky means it's just getting cloudy. A strong breeze shook the tree in front of his house and Max saw two heavy twigs or small sticks fall to the ground. One, two. What are you going to do with those sticks? Max's grandpa asked as he washed the front windows. Not saying a word, Max tapped on his thighs. Pat, pat, tat. Putter, putter, pat, tat. His rhythm, or repeated musical sounds, imitated the sounds of the pigeons startled or surprised into flight. When Max's mother came home carrying new hats for his twin sisters, she asked, What are you doing with Grandpa's cleaning bucket, son? Max responded by patting the bucket. Tap, tap, tap. Tippy, tip, tap. Tat. He created the rhythm of the light rain falling against the front windows. After a while, the clouds moved on and sun appeared. Cindy, Sean, and Jamal showed up drinking sodas. Hey, Max, what you doing with those hat boxes? Again. Max didn't answer. He just played on the boxes. Dum, dum, de dum. Dee, 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 dum, dum. Max drummed the beat of the tom toms in a marching band. And this is what tom toms look like. There they are, and there they are. What are you up to with those soda bottles? His dad asked as he brought out the garbage cans on his way to work. Max answered on the bottles. Dong, dang, dong. So he has up the bottles upside down on the fence. Ding, dong, ding. His music joined the chiming, or the sounds made by the bells, of the bells in the church around the corner. Soon the twins came out to show off their new hats. Hey Max, they asked, what are you doing with those garbage cans? Max hammered out a reply in the cans. Cling, clang, da bang! A cling, clang, da bang! Max pounded out the sound of the wheels thundering, which is a loud noise, down the tracks under the train in which his father worked as a conductor. A conductor is kind of like the boss on the train. Suddenly, Max heard thump dee dee thump, thump dee dee thump, as a marching band rounded or came around the corner. Max watched the drummers with amazement as they passed, copying their rhythms. The last drummer saw Max. Then with a nod and a wink, he tossed Max his spare set of sticks, which is what he uses to uh, play the drums with. Thanks, called Max, and he didn't miss a beat, which means he just kept on playing.